hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to copy the data which is present inside one table of a mysql database to a another table so sometimes there are very much occasions out there when we want to copy the data from one table to another table inside mysql database which is very much popular inside php so we will be looking at how to do it inside php 7 mysql so this will be a script so this is my php admin here which comes with exam control panel i have opened this you will see that you need to have this software installed it's a cross-platform software for windows linux and mac so install it and start the apache server and also mysql so here inside this guys we have this database of youtube and inside this we have got this table which is let me create a brand new table and show to you from scratch so let's suppose i create a user table and for this i will have the id uh, this will be auto auto incremented so this will be the primary key then we will have the name of the person the age of the person and country so these will be the four columns which will be there so this will be 256 256 and let me have 255 the length so this all will be varchar uh, this will be integer so i don't need to provide here the length but this will also be varchar so here we will create this table save it so now basically you will see that the table is created and we can insert some data into it so id will be automatically inserted so we can insert some of the names here the data so let me do this quickly here so now you can see two records have been successfully added here you will see that let me add two more records you can has you can have as many records as you want so this will just the copy paste functionality that you do inside your regular file system as well so So we have these four records so if I click go here now you will see four records are there here so I need to now copy these records to a different table which I will create here this is a user table here uh, I think this uh, this is a user table so I will now create a clone table which will be user clone so this will also have the four columns which are there so so beforehand you need to create these columns so columns will not be created you need to create the table and create the columns and columns need to be same the previous table whichever column that you created the order needs to be same name and then this needs to be the, exactly the same the serial wise how you created those columns the types need to be same the length also and varchar 255 so here auto increment let me auto increment this so now you can see that we have created this let me create this so we have created this clone table which is also have this four columns id name age country which this user also has which is id name age country so now we need to transfer this data which is four columns sorry four rows of data we need to transfer from, from this table to this table which is uh, user clone so how to do this using php so we will be looking at this php script so if you want to get this php script guys i have given the source code in the description of the video so i have written a complete blog post so this is the php script so you can go to the description of the video to download all the source code so now let me write this php script step by step so just open the php tags and here you need to first of all have your connection so basically this will be the mysql i connection that you will make here you need to provide four things so first is the username this will be localhost here and uh, 
sorry this is host not username so if you are working with the real server then you will put your website name username is the root which is default username password will be default which is nothing and the database name so db this is equal to youtube in my case so i will now pass all these four values which is host username root sorry user uh, password and db so once you pass these four things guys you can now connect to your database so connection is equal to false in that scenario we will just die and just say not connected to database so after this guys we can copy the records using the sql query here which we will write here so this is a sql query which is insert so here you need to insert whichever table name you need to copy so here you need to give the table name here so in this case i will give this table name which is called as uh, user clone user clone and here we need to select the data select star from which table we need to select the data uh, from this table which is user table so like this after this we will execute this query with the connection object we will use the query method and pass this sql query which is there if it is equal to true in that case our query is executed and here we can simply say to the user that data copied successfully so now this is in the else scenario we can simply say some error record in copying data and lastly we can close the connection so that's complete the php script guys now we can test it inside the browser just now you can see data copied successfully and if i check this you will now see user clone automatically got this data you can see that user clone before was empty now it exactly got this data which was present inside the user table so this is a simple copy paste script of php which allows you to transfer data from one table to another inside mysql so please hit the like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you the next tutorial